It's that time of year again. So many people are taking advantage of sales bonanzas, both in store and online around this weekend. And I think especially this year, it will be good to shop early and make a plan. You know, they're saying that the holiday season will be tough for people who wait until the last minute to do their shopping. So to help you out with your planning and budgeting, I've compiled some interesting gifts, gift ideas to share with you today. So if you're interested in hearing about knitting gifts to give for the holidays or birthdays or swaps or even to get yourself, then grab your knitting or other crafting, settle in and keep on watching for my Knitter's Gift Guide 2021. Hi everybody and welcome back to U University. I'm Dr. Kelly. I hope you had a good Thanksgiving this week to my American friends and to my Canadian friends. I hope you had a good Thanksgiving last month <laughs> and to everyone around the world, just a general happy harvest festival to you. The holiday season is in full swing now. I've been watching Christmas movies on the Hallmark Channel. Does anyone else love the cheesy Christmas movies. They all have the same predictable storyline, but they all have a happy ending and bring positivity to the world. I also have my sparkly green, bright green nail polish on. This polish is from KB Shimmer which is a small company in Indiana, and I love their nail polish. This one is called Kind of a Big Dill. Love that. So anyway, let's get right into the topic for today's video, gift ideas for knitters. Oh, and by the way, I have a whole playlist of gift ideas videos that I've done in previous years that I will link, and I'll link that playlist down below in the description box. There are a ton of great ideas in those videos too. Now this year, I thought I would do something a little bit different. I got to thinking what I like to do when I give gifts is put together kind of a themed gift. Um, so I think about besides knitting, what are that person's interests? And I try to combine the knitting with that other interest. So what I've done today is put together 10 ideas for themes or maybe bundles that you could put together for a fun gift. And these specific examples that I'm gonna talk about today might work for you or somebody in your life, or they might serve as inspiration for you to put together your own themed gift. So what I do when I put together these gift bundles for my friends is, um, I usually start with yarn. So I try to find a yarn that reflects their interest. And then I find a few other things that just go along with that theme. Now, just in general, keep in mind things like project bags, coffee mugs, and stitch markers, because you can almost always find those items in whatever theme you might be looking for. Okay, so let me start with my examples. This first theme is for a reading enthusiast. I know that a lot of knitters also love to read. So I was searching for some yarn, uh, some reading themed yarn, and I found this beautiful Jane Austen collection from Willow Cottage Yarn on Etsy. You could pick your friend's favorite character and get the yarn named after that character. Or if they're a fan of other books, you can find dozens and dozens of yarn dyers that make yarns in colorways inspired by different books. Like you can probably find a million Harry Potter yarns. Um, I've seen some Outlander themed yarns, um, Handmaid's Tale yarns, Hunger Game yarn. Just think about what's your friend's favorite book and see if you can find some yarn dyed in a colorway representing that book or even a character in that book. Then you can pair that yarn with some other reading themed goodies, like this soy candle in a scent called The Library. I've bought this one before from my local bookstore and I really like the scent. In fact, this candle is part of a whole literary theme collection. 
I also think these library card socks would be a fun gift. You can get them at Uncommon Goods. Yeah, so there's some ideas for a gift bundle for someone who loves to read. You get the yarn and some other goodies. How fun would that be to get a gift like that? My next theme idea is for a wine connoisseur. I know a lot of knitters are also wine drinkers. So for someone like this, here is a beautiful yarn called Pinot Nittoir by a girl and her wool on Etsy. Here's another option. This one is called A Sip of Wine by Splash of Color Yarns on Etsy. Again, this is a situation where you could probably find dozens of wine-inspired yarns if you do a little search for your friend's favorite wine. To pair with the yarn, you could get this wine glass holder for the bathtub. I mean, maybe you could even give them some wine-themed bubble bath, like this one from Pretty Posh Things on Etsy. And they could put this wine glass holder on the wall next to the tub and enjoy some downtime. Shoot, they could even put it in their shower. Now, wine drinkers might also find a wine stain remover to be useful, so that could be part of your bundle. Or how about this wine lover's board game? It's called Somify, a wine tasting board game. That sounds kind of fun. So you could make a really cool wine related gift bundle for your wine loving knitting friends. Another idea is for knitters who are also tea lovers. And I know a lot of knitters who drink tea. Now there are quite a few tea themed yarns out there. Here's one called Green Tea from Molly Klein Design on Etsy. And here's another one from Wonderland Yarns in the colorway Tea Tray. Such a pretty gray. Of course, you could pair the yarn with some tea. And for that, I found this Best Sellers Collection from Harney and Sons Teas. You could also, of course, give a knitting themed mug like this one from Catabird on Etsy. It says a ball of yarn, a cup of tea, a comfy chair, a happy me. Super cute. How perfect is that? And how about this warming coaster that is scented with cinnamon and clove? You put it in the microwave and warm it up and then set your mug on it and it keeps your drink warm. I think any tea lover who's a knitter will adore a themed gift like this. Okay, so let's talk about favorite animals. A lot of knitters are cat lovers and I found quite a few yarns with a cat theme. Look at this beautiful Meow collection by Ancient Arts Yarns in Canada. They have so many different cat breeds represented in this yarn line. Another cat themed yarn I saw is this collection from an Etsy shop called Catnap in Indy. Now all these yarns are pre-orders, so I'm not sure how long it would take to fulfill an order and get it sent out. But another idea is to request a custom order. So you could contact the dyer and send her a picture of your friend's cat and she could make a custom colorway specifically for your friend. And I think that would be a wonderful gift. And then to go along with the cat themed yarn, you could get some cute cat stitch markers like these from the Sexy Knitter on Etsy. There is also this pattern book called Knits for Kitties that you could give. It has a whole bunch of adorable kitty toys to knit. So yeah, you could easily put together a cat themed gift bundle for someone. And we don't want to leave out our dog loving friends. You know, Ancient Arts Yarns also has a woof collection, which showcases pretty much any dog breed you could want. Another fun item you could give with a dog theme is something from the pets collection from Wool and the Gang. These are kits that include both the pattern and the yarn together. And you or your friend could make a bandana, a sweater, a bed, or a blanket for their dog. You could also get them a dog calendar like these. You can find a calendar for any dog breed on calendars.com. 
And then here's a fun one. How about getting them a Dogopoly game? It looks like a fun game that is all about dogs. I saw this one on Amazon, and they also have board games for specific dog breeds like Labs, Boxers, Yorkies, Golden Retrievers, Bulldogs, and more. So you can make a nice dog-themed gift bundle out of some of these ideas. And while we're on the animal theme, let's talk about chickens. Raising chickens in the backyard is very popular. And maybe your knitting friend is a chicken, chicken keeper. So for chicken themed yarn, Hugh Loco has a whole collection of yarn dyed in colorways inspired by backyard chickens. Here you can see the beautiful yarns and the chicken varieties that they're inspired by. Another place to get chicken themed yarn is at Chicken Coop Dye Works, but with them, their yarn bases are named after chickens or something to do with chickens. So you could pick a base that you like and then get whatever colorway appeals to you. And what else could you get to go along with this chicken yarn? <laughs> well, maybe something like this chicken project bag by Down Home Creations on Etsy, super cute. And what about an egg collecting apron? I found this one with 12 little egg pockets on Amazon for $15. Or you could get some kitchen towels with chickens on them, like these I found on walmart.com. Um, this chicken theme would be another really fun gift package. Here's another idea. Your knitting friend might also be a gardener. So if you're looking for a garden themed yarn, here's one called Secret Garden that you can get at Webs, which is yarn.com. This is a DK weight or light worsted weight yarn. And in this gorgeous collection, there are 17 different colorways. So you can pick whatever their favorite color scheme is. Now to go along with that yarn, you could get something like this pretty garden tool set, which is $20 on Amazon. It comes in two different designs. Both are so beautiful and it has high ratings from over 1800 reviews. Another garden themed idea is this Vera Bradley throw, which I have and I love it. This is a fleece throw blanket that is super soft, warm and cozy. This particular design is called Garden Grove and it has flowers all over it with a navy background. It doesn't look like it's available on VeraBradley.com anymore, but you can still get it on Amazon for around $50. And this throw comes in 45 different patterns, and many of those are flower or garden related designs. Anyway, I think you could easily find some items to put together as a gift package for a, a gardening knitter. Does your friend like to go hiking or go on walks through the woods? Or maybe they're a nature lover or even a conservationist. Well, I have some ideas for somebody who might fit that description. So for yarn, you could go with earth yarns and that's U-R-T-H, earth yarns. Their yarn is hand dyed by women artisans in Turkey. And the neat thing about this company is that they plant trees. So for every skein of yarn purchased, they plant a tree and they've planted hundreds of thousands of trees so far. They work in partnership with Trees for the Future to plant trees in Africa, which improves the standard of living of people living in poverty. So you could pick any of the yarn bases or colors, whatever your friend's favorite is. All their yarns are gorgeous and would be a great gift for anyone, but especially someone who's environmentally focused or like I said, someone who, you know, enjoys the forest. Okay, so what could you put together with this yarn for kind of a, a woodsy theme? Well, how about this book, Watercolor with Me in the Forest? I think it would be so fun and relaxing to go into the woods and just sit and play around with art. I've actually gotten this book as a gift for a friend and they love it. 
Another idea for a gift package might be this hand lotion. This is juniper berry scented lotion from Blackfeet Trading Post. And this lotion is actually made by members of the Blackfeet Nation in Montana. Yeah, so those are some ideas for knitters who are passionate about the woods and environmentalism. Maybe your knitting friend is also a musician or loves listening to music. Well, I found a couple of yarn options for music fans. And one is this collection of music inspired yarn from Molly Girl Yarn in New Jersey. All of these lovely yarns have to do with songs or music in some way. Another option for music themed yarn is from Chicken Lady Fiber Arts. They have a yarn collection called Misheard Lyrics. These are also lovely yarns, and the colorways are named for song lyrics that people mistakenly sing, like, I can't go for that, or hold me closer, Tony Danza. <laughs> so besides the yarn, some other music themed gift ideas to include are these record coasters that I saw at Uncommon Goods for under $20. These are coasters made out of the labels cut out of the center of real classic vinyl records. Now, because they're upcycled from whatever records they can get a hold of, you never know exactly what you'll get in the set that you buy. But I just thought this would be so much fun for a music lover. Another idea is this card game called Game That Song. I haven't played it before, but from what I can tell, you pick a card which gives some instruction about a type of song, and then everyone needs to think of a song that fits that category, and then you take turns playing your song for like 30 seconds. Now, it's got great reviews on Amazon, and a lot of people were saying that hearing the songs that different people think of brings back, brings back so many good memories. So I was thinking it would make a great, awesome gift for a music lover. And those are some music themed gift ideas. I was trying to think of some other gift idea themes and I thought maybe some knitters would also be interested in astronomy like I am. Yeah, I like to go stargazing and watch meteor showers and things like that. So I looked for some astronomy themed yarn and of course I found some. This is the Solar System Collection by Destination Yarn. The colorways are inspired by photos taken by NASA. And for each planetary colorway, you can choose the yarn base. They have different yarn weights from fingering to bulky and different fiber compositions as well. Aren't these just beautiful? This one is Pluto and this one is Mercury, just to give you a couple examples. Another yarn option might be this one called Stargazer by Flower Garden Yarns on Etsy. This one's really pretty too. So what else could you get an astronomy loving knitter? Well, how about these Planet Earth earrings, which I found at the Audubon shop for $14. And look at this lighted crystal ball with a mini solar system model inside of it. It's so beautiful. And that is around $40 on Amazon. Now, how about this Cassini spacecraft poster from art.com? You might be thinking, okay, it's a random space related poster, but the Cassini spacecraft actually has a, an interesting, maybe a little weird connection to knitting. I don't know if you guys remember, but um, Cassini was a spacecraft that allowed scientists to study the planet Saturn for 13 years. It orbited that planetary system 294 times at different distances and angles. And this orbital pattern was dubbed the ball of yarn by the mission scientists in charge of that spacecraft. So I love that it is kind of linked to a knitting theme. Well, I've given you 10 ideas for themed gifts for knitters, and I think I'm gonna end there for today. But again, keep in mind that even if these exact themes don't work for you, they are meant to stimulate you to think of what your knitting friend's interests are beyond knitting, and then try to relate those interests to knitting. You can pretty much find yarn inspired by anything in the world, 
whether your friend's other hobbies are baking, writing, painting, photography, dancing, movies, video games, whatever it is. The list is endless. But I hope this video gave you some ideas of the types of things you could put together and make a great gift for any knitter on your list. So yeah, let me know if you're gonna try doing anything gift bundles for anyone this holiday season and whether you might be interested in any of the items I talked about or maybe you thought of some others. Um, you should definitely share those. I would love to hear from all of you. You can leave your comments down below in the comment section and remember that I will also provide links to everything I talked about in today's video down below in the description box. I hope you have a great start to your holiday season. I do have some more gift ideas that didn't really fit into this video, so I'm gonna to try to put them into another video soon, so stay tuned for that. So I'll see you next time, and until then, stay smart and have a sparkly week.